Hey guys, this is Ronick from PR Tech Views, and we all love LG's double tap to lock. Now, I'm here with the Nexus 7 uh, 2013 model, and I was wondering if there was an app that would do just that, if I could double tap to lock. Uh, so, I researched and I downloaded a bunch of apps, and I only found one that works. So, I looked all over the Play Store, and I came up and I downloaded this app right here. It's called DTSO. So when you click on it, ta da, it says wake or sleep. What happens when you click wake? So when you click wake, you need a proximity sensor in order for you to be able to unlock it. Now, the Nexus 7 does not have the proximity sensor, so I can't do that. But you can make it go to sleep, which is on the bottom half of the screen. It says sleep. Right, so when you click sleep, you can get, let's see, you have uh, a bunch of options right here. You can get a floating widget, which I have disabled, I don't like it. Uh, basically, you have a little widget that follows you all around, but I don't like that. Next, you have the notification drawer widget, which is right here. You got a double tap, and it'll lock. And you have proximity lock which the Nexus 7 doesn't have uh, a proximity lock a proximity sensor and the home screen widgets which are pretty cool alright so I'm gonna move this a little bit down and I'm gonna add the widget oh wait, that's not how you add a widget you gotta go here to widgets and we're gonna look for the DTSO here it is so I'm going to use the DTSO transparent widget. Alright, I'm going to put it over here. And it's invisible. Let's see, there. So when you go like that, boom, make the surface area huge. Just like that. Now, look how big the surface area is, right? So this is where you want to double tap to lock. It's pretty cool. So you double tap, and it locks. Now, I'm going to download it on my Galaxy S4, which I believe should have a proximity sensor, and we'll see if it works from there. Alright guys, so I'm here with my Galaxy S4, and I'm going to go to the Play Store. Wait for it. And then I'm going to say DTSO. And there it is right here, double tap screen uh, on off, and install it. Accept. Wait for install. All right, now it's installing. Okay. Open. All right. So let's see if the wake works. I'm kind of interested to see that. All right. So we're gonna go ahead and click activate. Enable. Let's see. Let's figure out how to do this. Settings. All right. Uh, I have no idea. Security. No security. That's what we need. Okay, okay, that works. No. Okay, isn't your proximity center like over here? So maybe. Oh, oh. Ah, that's how you do it. All right, all right, all right. Cool. So that's how you do it, guys. I literally just found out. Okay. So, your phone is off. Hey. All right. So it's not actually double tap. Because if you double tap anything, it won't work. So your proximity sensor is over here. Uh, I forget which one. I think that's your IR. No, your IR blaster is on here. Some whoa, whoa! I never turned told it to turn on. This is weird. Oh, that is sick! All right, guys, I have to show you from a different angle. This is pretty. Okay, guys, so because it uses the proximity sensor, you technically don't even have to touch your phone, and it will turn on. So you can tell that my phone is off right now. And watch, I'm not even gonna touch it. One, two. 
turned on. That is sick. Oh, snap. That is pretty cool. Let's try that again. So my phone is off. You can tell. I'm not even going to touch it. One. Oh, I touched it. That's cheating. All right, let's wait for it to reset. Okay, I think it's good. Okay, I'm going to not even touch it. One, two. Oh, that is sick. That is pretty cool. So not only can you set it up to uh, have the proximity sensor on, but you can also say how how many times you want to click uh, before it'll turn on. Oh, just touch my camera. So right now it's set to two clicks, so we can actually just do one. Okay, let's do three. All right, that's pretty cool. I think three will be good. So let's see how, how well three works. I set it on the ground. All right, one, two, three. Oh, it worked. That is sick. That is pretty cool. I think the proximity sensor on the Galaxy S4 is, uh, let's see, let me get a pencil so I can point it out. I think, I think, I think, it's uh, this one right here. This little thing, I think that's it. This is your camera. I have no idea what that is. I also have no idea what that is. So it could be any th any of these three. This one, this one, or this one. But yeah, guys, I hope that wasn't too long. I was hoping it would be under five minutes. But if it uh, entertained you, if you gained knowledge, or if you learned how to use this proximity unlock, then give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe for new content. Uh, hopefully, we can get new videos every week, maybe more. But show us your support and click that like button. Uh, I'll have a link to this app, uh, Play Store, on your description, which is, you know, right next to that like button. But either way, guys, hope you liked the video, and I will see you in my next video. Peace.